From the time I was a kid, my maternal uncle used to act way too comfortable with all the kids. It wasn't a problem for me until I was a teenager and was aware of what was a good touch and bad touch. I told my mother about his behavior and how him touching me makes me feel uncomfortable. She told me to keep a safe distance whenever there's a family gathering to protect myself. After all, he was the eldest in the family and according to her, ye to unki aadat hai. Makes me wonder if she had similar experiences. Well, I was not allowed to speak against him in my own house. I was 19 when I con- confronted him at my house. When I was making salad in the kitchen and he came and he spanked my ass and I was stunned. I went to my room that day directly as mom always said keep a safe distance. But I realized that it was wrong and I need to protect all the other girls in my family too. And I told my parents that with or without their support I'm going to say this out loud. I told him to fuck off from my house and now all my relatives and my family knows the incident. Hashtag #me too. I have a second cousin who's like a decade older than me. When I was 11, he pulled me into a room and we started talking as usual. But then he suddenly started kissing my neck and pressing my breasts. I did not know what to do. I just stayed silent because I was so so scared. I cried for hours after that. Now I have to see him every year at functions and family gatherings and I pretend like nothing ever happened. It's not fair. I was around 8 or 9 years old. My brother asked me if I ever wanted to kiss someone. I watched people kiss in movies and was curious. Didn't know it wasn't something to be done with family. He asked me if I wanted to kiss him. I said yes. Started out like that. Progressed over the days to me being naked and him touching me all over and making me rub his dick. One day I just refused to do it anymore and it all stopped. Years after when I would learn about sexual abuse would I realize what had actually happened to me was abuse but I still have an extremely strong and loving relationship with my brother not that it validates the abuse I still wonder if he remembers if he ever thinks that I remember if he ever thinks that I blame myself for it sometimes even though I know that I shouldn't because my naive self consent my naive self consented to it after all I was a child and I didn't know anything and he shouldn't have taken advantage of me but I consented nonetheless has he ever thought that I would blame myself for it